Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen of this esteemed jury, I may not be a fancy city lawyer. Heck, I may not even be the fancy city lawyer type. I'm just a man, a simple man. A simple man who stands before you today accused of committing a truly terrible act. Am I guilty? Who's to say? I, of course, would say no. I would say that no, I did not, in fact, commit this heinous crime. Now, does my accuser hold any sort of proof that I committed this act? Again, who's to say? Are video and photographic evidence of me committing this crime proof? Perhaps? Are the various social media posts that I made uh, taking credit and downright bragging about committing said crime proof? Perhaps. So, the question stands. Did I defecate upon Mrs. Boozlebaum's cherished flower garden? Did I find myself drunkenly rifling through a Taco Bell dumpster at 3 a.m. where I found and consumed several well past their prime Chalupa Supremes, continue on my way home, feel a rumble in my tummy, stumble into Mrs. Boozlebaum's garden, drop trow, and spread my butt butter atop her prized petunias? Perhaps, perhaps I did, perhaps I did, or perhaps the courtroom theatrics of Mr. Fancy Pants Prosecution have merely cast me as a villain. Perhaps he has shown a light on the true crime being committed here today. The crime of classism. The only crime I stand guilty of is the crime of being viewed as a second-class citizen. And why? Hmm? Because I live amongst the seagulls down by the harbor, learning from them, sustaining myself on the remnants of family picnics, and yes, the occasional dumpster chalupa. You. You look down on me from atop your ivory tower where you sit on your ivory porcelain throne. Well, let me ask, in my hour of need, where was I supposed to make a poopy? In my pants? In the street, like a common animal? Or was I supposed to make a duty in an award-winning flower garden, like a man? I am just a man, am I not? Like you, I err, but I am just a man. If you prick me, do I not bleed? If you tickle me, <laughs> do I not laugh? If you feed me 3 a.m. dumpster chalupas, do I not get the booty scoots? In this world, we reap what we sow, be it immaculate flowers in a garden to be used as a squatty spotty, or be it consuming beef and cheese that no man should consume, and the vicious, 
agonizing horror that comes along with it. I have regrets. Many about that day I regret all my actions, from dumpster to flower garden. I know if I had the choice again, I would not make the same choice as I made that night. And I know that I have caused grievous damage, both to my accuser and to myself. No punishment that you could serve to me could compare to the punishment that I have been served by the dumpster chalupa. My anus has burned with the heat of a thousand suns since that night, and no amount of tears that I shed can quench those fires that roar below, nor can they vanquish the guilt that resides in my heart. Today, I ask that you let this simple man walk free while he still can. <laughs>